Hey everybody, good morning or good afternoon wherever you are in the world. Coach Rob here, your host um, for Trend Rise Made Simple Community. Question came up for um, how to rearrange training phases in a master program. And um, it is a feature we used to have a while back and I think we all missed it. All of us clients and Trend Rise included with some enhancement or feature upgrade, it got lost and then a lot of us started catching on down the road and you know, now it's something I'm, I'm sure they'll eventually get back in there. <clears throat> and uh, there'll be a link down below here I'll post in as far as to vote the idea back in because it, it would be nice. Um, but what I want to do is show you the workaround or the kind of the iteration in which you can achieve this. Um, it does require a little bit of work and for a little bit of focus, uh, but it can be done so it's not impossible. So what we're going to do is we're looking at my master programs list here of all my tags and all that. This is my trading reference area I created so that I can have some dedicated stuff to demonstrate things. To do an easy example, we're going to go look at this three phase by four weeks each template, you know, what I call one training block. And I'll use, um, Lanny Hudgens asked the question this morning, I'll use her example. If she wants to introduce a um, onboarding week or intro, some type of a basic one week training in the very front of things. So to do that, we have to get it in there first. So we're going to add the next phase first. So I'll type this in and put intro week. And it's going to be one week for just for onboarding. And I'm going to put that in there. Now that's right here at the end. And it's not where we want it. <laughs> we want it in the beginning. So this is the way you do it. And of course, the more things you want to reorder, the more complex it's going to be. It's doable but it just means you have to think through things a little bit more complicated. It's going to be like playing um, uh, Tetris or something like that as things filter down. you got to move them around. So the thing is, is I want the intro week at the first, and then I want phase one, phase two, phase three right after that. The way I do this is if I go duplicate a training phase, it's going to create a copy. And when it creates that copy, it's going to post it as the next program. So if I wanted this intro week to be, say, after phase two, I would simply duplicate phase three. That copy would be posted below, and then I would delete the original phase three, and it would go phase one, phase two, intro week, phase three. But I want it at the top. So what I want in the end is intro week, phase one, phase two, phase three. So the next one that goes below is phase one. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come duplicate phase one, I'm gonna leave it called copy, you can rename it. So I'm gonna duplicate that. So phase one copy. And now I want phase two to come next. Phase two, I, I think you guys know where we're going with this by now. <laughs> and duplicate here. All right, so now I have my intro week and all these copies. Now I need to go back and delete. And delete. And drum roll, please. Oh, no, not duplicate. Make sure you read your screen. Oh, come on. Settle down, Rob. Delete. <laughs> there we go. So now, just like that. So it's several iterations. It's a little bit of focus and knowing what you want it to look like in the end to get these pieces aligned the way you want. But you can see I did it in a relatively short order of time. And, and honestly, this is a basic example. I've done it other times when it's been a bit more complex. And I actually, I grab my legal pad and write out what I'm looking for so I know how to do it. Because sometimes I'm rearranging phases as that's going to be easier than changing all the exercises and doing those types of things. So there are ways to do almost everything within Trainerize. Thanks for asking the question. And um, you know, I hope this helps everybody as far as between now and when Trevor and the development team get something like this in. Vote for the link down below so that we can um, get this elevated in their attention and get it implemented. But this is how you rearrange in a master program as of right now. Thanks, everybody. Have an awesome rest of your day. And by the way, thanks for being in the group.